My name is Oscar Romero, and um, I'm an FIU student as well. Um, by day and in, in the afternoons, I actually work at Strong International. I've been working here for about four years now, and what that kind of entails is, you know, during the days I would enter um, public schools, whether it be high schools, middle schools. Sometimes we'd even go to juvenile detention centers and we teach our students some curriculums. So today we're going to be talking about a topic called emotional needs. Now, um, do you guys think it's important for you guys? Do you guys think you need emotions? Um, our curriculum extends from healthy relationships. We teach them a lot about self-worth. We teach them a lot about you know making healthy decisions for the future to ultimately become strong individuals. These are enrichment programs that allow students to come in sort of like a safe haven instead of being out in the neighborhoods or maybe hanging with the wrong crowd. We give them a few hours where they could come, they could do their homework. We give them some life lessons, we give them activities and recreation activities as well. We teach them from cooking, we teach them karate, we teach them how to uh, write poetry, how to rap as well. And we give them a whole bunch of tools how to express what maybe they can't express either at home or even at, work, uh, at, their, at their schools. You know, when I graduated high school, I didn't really have any plans or goals for life. Um, I wasn't planning on going to college because nobody in my family went to college. They just went straight to work. Um, and thankfully, I did go to college eventually. And, um, you know, I didn't really have any goals. And I remember leaving high school for the last day as a senior. And I remember thinking, wow, I, I don't ever got to be back in school ever again. And little by little, I found myself working within the school system. The reason it's changed my life is because I'm the oldest out of five. And as a child, I always wanted a big brother to kind of guide me in the right direction. Now I feel like I have a chance to be that older brother to many other young children. Most people that would come and see these kids, they'd say, these kids are come from a rough background. It's like, are you sure you want to work with them? Absolutely. These are, to me, these are regular kids. These are kids full of compassion, full of love, full of potential, and so much more. Um, and I feel like it's up to us to harness that potential and allow them to become the greatest individuals that they can become.